when you came to work for me, I taught you everything I could about life as well as business. I told you never lose your temper. Do not let events overtake you. I think we both have to listen to that warning now and consider our actions very carefully before we do something we can't take back. And we both lose. You saw the paper today, right? I hate that Emily's subjected to that. Then garage. why'd you put her in that situation? I realized that if, if I had been honest about my relationship with Emily, this wouldn't have happened. I take full responsibility, Jason. What, what am I supposed to say to that, Sonny? It still happened. And you're part of the reason. I'm part of the reason. We were, we were hiding from you. And the way you've been acting, maybe we were right to hide. No, the reason is you and Emily don't want to hear the truth. You That's tore the into reason. your sister in the police station. You were deliberately cruel to her. Why? All Emily's done is f follow her heart. All I've done is return her feelings. You don't approve, fine. That's, that's your right. But how, to, to lash out on her like you did at the police station is unacceptable. Maybe you're right. Maybe I was unreasonable with Emily. I've never been scared like this before. I've been against this ever since Carly told me that you and Emily were getting together. I wanted to handle this right so we wouldn't end up where we are right now. We both, you know, not, none of us handled this right. I knew you and Emily were sleeping together. You went out of town to Spain. You lied to my face about it. I swallowed the lies, pretended to believe, because I don't want this confrontation. Why does there have to be a confrontation? We're, we, Emily and I, we're both adults. Emily just we're got hurt, Emily. Sonny. She's, she's going to get hurt party. again. Are you in love she with her? her is, this, is this the last so time, the big... your last time in happiness? What is it? Hello. Jason, it's, it's me. I'm at the hospital. I'm on the fourth floor. Manny Ruiz just kidnapped Elizabeth Spencer at night point. I'll be right there. What happened? So much for your peace plan. Mandy just took Elizabeth hostage. You see, this is, is exactly what I'm talking about. One more innocent person gets hurt because you're too distracted by Emily to pay attention to business. You're hurting me. I'm sorry, Elizabeth. Are you okay, Princess? <laughs> Ooh. Careful, you don't want to fall down there. Okay, there's hardly any patients in the store today. I know because I watched the floor. I scrubbed it this morning, you know. As a janitor, I get access to all kinds of useful information. Oh, why aren't we going down? The exit is downstairs. We should be going down. Hey, come on, Elizabeth. You and I both know that the cops are going to be blocking all the exits. Figuring that I'll do something dramatic like take you out by knife point or something. I'm gonna put you in a body bag. Any sign of Manny or Elizabeth? Nothing so far. Then he's found a way out of the hospital. Manny is still here. He must be hiding somewhere in the building. We're starting a floor to floor what search. Jason, is Elizabeth been found? No, not yet. How did you find out about this? I called my son. I wish you hadn't have done that. Well, I'm sorry, Mac, but I thought it was the right thing to do. Commissioner! This is a police investigation, Jason. Okay. What happened? I wasn't here when Manny kidnapped Elizabeth, but I know he has a knife, and I believe that he took her through the south corridor. Okay, how many, how many stairwells and elevators are accessible from that corridor? Four or five. Alcazar, go on locations of all your safe houses. My people are already searching Okay, for you Manny. were working with Manny. You double-crossed him. Manny likes to play games. He might decide to use your own network against you. I will give you access, but only to bring Elizabeth back safely. We think we've located Manny and Elizabeth in an elevator, stuck between the second and third okay, floor. Okay. I'm going to go with the, re the rescue team, okay? Wait, hold it. You quit the force. You can't be a part of this. Hello? 
Elizabeth, look at me. Look at me. Now, I apologize for the inconvenience, really. But the morgue is our best bet for getting out of the hospital, you know? You can just leave me here. Yeah, but I still need you for leverage, you know? I'll be right back. Okay. I don't want to hurt you. And I'm sorry that you got involved. I really wish you would have stayed out of it. And I bet you probably feel the same way now, huh? You can scream all you want. There's no one here to hear you. Why would I scream? You already promised me you wouldn't hurt me. That's right. You know, Elizabeth, I like that you believe in me. And it worked out like I said, didn't it? We went right out through the morgue, right? And now we're going to go across the harbor as soon as I get the boat prepped. Don't cry, it's okay. I don't like that. Hey, Lucky. You have one chance to save your wife. I'll be up here 52. Come alone, unarmed. If I think you have a gun, I'll kill Elizabeth. No, Lucky, please don't call me. Hey, 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 where are you going? They stopped the elevator. Was it fall asleep? The cops haven't been able to find Elizabeth in the hospital. We're still looking. Okay, I'm gonna go search on my own. Lucky! Listen, Mac, if you want to stop me, you're gonna have to shoot me. All right, go. But call us if you locate Manny or Elizabeth. Don't be a hero or try to rescue her. Uh, police, they have roadblocks. Airport's been alerted. We just gotta make sure Manny doesn't try to escape by water. Just call me if you find out anything. I thought you should know that Manny spent a lot of time talking to that janitor. I'm gonna need your help. You've got a spill in room 412. Get on it. You got it. something? Not a thing, because I'm concentrating on my work, like you should be doing. Thanks. A few things might be broken in there, but I'll handle it. I'll go find Elizabeth. Back, huh? That was quick. Oh, just let her go. Put the gun down and take her from me. Come on, Frank. Come on. Oh, Lucky! Oh. Hey, Lucky, are you okay? Man, it looks painful, man. You want me to put you out of your misery? Huh? Sorry, Elizabeth. No, no, Manny! 
don't. Talk to me. Let her go. He needs an ambulance. Elizabeth, we're leaving, Manny, remember? please, he needs help. Elizabeth, the only reason your husband is still alive is because you love him. Now, I owe you because you were decent to me, and I always repay my debts. You can leave her out or no. Just let her go. And give up my insurance policy? I don't think so. Come on, we're going for a boat ride. Let her go. Hey, what's up? Uh, I don't think so. I got a better idea. Why don't you put that gun down? Drop killer, man. Drop the gun, man. Or the princess does. Let her go or I'll blow your head off. You hear that, Elizabeth? Your husband had the good sense not to take a shot at me and risk hitting you. But this course. Pier 52. You took a bad fall. Okay, you need to stay still. You could do more damage, please. Just send an ambulance. Let him be okay. I can help you. Okay. I know you tried to help me, baby. I know you did fine. Right here, on the ground. And Manny, he had Elizabeth over there. He was going to try to get in the boat and escape. Still had the knife to her throat? Yeah, the whole time. And just for a split second, Elizabeth was able to free herself. I had a clear shot, so I took him, and he went through the railing. He must have landed in the boat. I grabbed Elizabeth. He started taking off across the harbor. I shot four or five times, and I must have hit something. There was an explosion. Well, we'll drag the harbor, but I'm not hopeful. He won't find his body. That's what I'm thinking. The current's pretty strong here. Manny's still alive. stopped a long time ago. How did you even know where to find me? Monica called me when Manny took you hostage, and then one of the nurses pointed out one of Manny's goons, and he told me where to find you. Which nurse? The one who took Lucky into surgery, the tough one. Epiphany. Epiphany. I could not have found you without her help. You're the one who stopped Manny. Mm -hmm. You were pretty quick on your feet. You saved your own life. I'm so glad to see anyone. You guys are safe. I was uh, just thanking Jason for saving my life. I must have been terrified. How lucky was it that he got to you in time? This whole thing should have never happened. He's just, he's afraid for you and he doesn't know how to deal with it. You just you need to have a little patience, okay? Yeah. Jason blames Sonny for Manny taking you and now Sonny's blaming himself. What Manny did was nobody's fault but his own. I don't blame Sonny. You can tell him that for me. An hour ago, I wasn't so sure that I was going to be with him. But that was before Nicholas, of all people, told me to follow my heart. <laughs> 